Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Proud here. I'm back with another Wi-Fi battle. We post wins, loses, draws. As you may question middle of the video at the end of the video. And guys, I hope you guys had a good new year. Um, I'm gonna start posting some new battles for you guys. 6v6 singles, some double battles, and also uh, new to the channel, I'm gonna have some coaching video for you guys. You know what I mean? To help you guys out um with battling and all that grand stuff. But um yeah, let's get started, man. Looking at my opponent's team, he's working with a lot of overview scary threats, man. You know what I mean? The Breloom, the Goldango, um, Iron Tusk. But um, I'm out here, man. You see the brute run out, man. My boy Kung Lao from Mortal Kombat. And we're going to see if we can um, stress this team out, if we could uh, defeat this guy's team. It's a very, very scary team. And with that being said, man, let's get started. Hit the intro. <laughs> And also, guys, if you guys like this content, please like and subscribe. And also, I am going to show you guys my Pokemon team sets so you guys can see uh, at the end of the video. And with that being said, let's go. So, he's going to lead off with the Grimstone, and I'm going to go into my Glamora. And I mean, two Gs going head to head. And um, here I am standing with my cool balloon. And um, here, I, this thing is going to set up the light screen. I'm like, that is fine. I'm going to toss some um, sewage, sewage water on this thing. And um, that does some good damage, even with the light screen up. So um, he is going to switch up out of here because he got some sewage water in his mouth. And uh, he's like, that's nasty. I'm going to take another one. He's going to go into the Great Tusk. And um, I'm like, okay, that's fine. You know what I mean? Because uh, it, it can't go for an earthquake. I do have a balloon on me. <laughs> A balloon is really carrying the Glamour. That's crazy. But um, anyways, I'm going to set up the Stealth Rocks here um, to get residual damage. But here, I decided to switch up because I know that uh, uh, Rapid Spin is coming. And I was thinking about going to my um, my Skeledurge. But I don't want to take a headlong rush to the face. So um, I decided to go into my uh, my Toys R Us. My boy, my guy, Frigorath. I'm um, here. Uh, he actually goes for the ice spinner, and then he goes for the rapid spin. So I'm, I'm like, that's fine. You know what I mean? I just want to set up my teams here. So I do go for the reflect. I was thinking about going for the twin beam, but I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna take care of this great touch later. We got something for him. And um, yeah, we, he decides to switch out. So he decides to switch out and go to Grimstone. I'm like, okay, that's fine. You know what I mean? Um, I'm assuming expecting a psychic move for from the from the frig wrap but i'm like nah nah we're gonna double switch man i'm gonna go out to my beautiful moth man you come out here you know what i mean um so here he actually does another switch i'm like what's wrong with this guy man pick your pokemon my guy and i'm here he goes out to the gold dango it's out here man string cheese yeah man pokemon um i'm gonna go for the quiver dance and i'm gonna do my little ballerina dance beautiful get my special attack special defense and speed up and um here i decided to uh to wrestleize because I know that these gold dangles tend to carry like power gem and moves that I, I hate. So I do terrestrialize here and I turn it to Terra Water. Yo, this Pokemon is actually dope. I had another match with this uh, Mon here and it actually swept the team. But I didn't record it because, you know what I mean, I was off the Hennessy. But um, anyways, uh, this thing is going to go for the power gem. Head. Power gem does no damage, you know what I mean? And we're going to get a second... Um, Quiver dance up. So this gold dangle outspeed me. So it tells me that this uh gold dangle is choice scuff. I'm like, okay, duly noted. And um here he's gonna go into back scalibur, which was a good play on my opponent's spot because I do go for the terror blast here, and um we go for the terror blast here, plus two. And look at that damage. That damage was pitiful. What the heck happened? But come to find out that he did have the light screen up. So um, I am gonna go for the bug bus scream on this Godzilla's air and um that does good damage, but um, here's gonna go for the Glaive Rust. This Glaive Rust, unbelievable. Un I, I'm not sure if I, I, I thought I had to reflect up or something, but um, yeah, that Glaive Rust does heaps to me, and um, the Ice Shard is able to take on my Frost Moth, man. Crazy, you know what I mean? But that Pokemon, it, it, it put in a lot of work, man. You know what I mean? You guys should try to use it. Um, I'm gonna go out to my own back scalp, but I'm like, all right, I should go for Ice Shard, I should take it out. It doesn't take it out. I'm like, oh, man. So. Here he is gonna go for a glaive rush. Glaive rush does uh, good damage, but we do have to reflect up, and we have to have him barrier to take that relatively nicely. So um, my team reflects on where if I'm gonna go for another ice shot. That's enough to take out this god dang, god dang uh, lizard with a sword in his back Pokemon. Um, here he's gonna go out to the Grim style again. I'm like, all right, 
this is a bad matchup for me so i decided to switch out because uh, i don't want to take a spirit break to the face so i am going to go into my um my glamour again and uh here the griffin is going to go for the um the reflect so i'm like okay he's just trying to set up some screens so um, here i decided just to go for a sludge wave but um he actually makes a smart play here and he does switches out and uh he goes out into the gold dango so Gold Dango comes out here and I go for the Sludge Wave and that's obviously not going to do anything to this thing. So I'm going to switch up out of here and uh, I decided just to go into my um, my Ken K Road, my boy, my guy, Skeledurge. And uh, here, um, he goes for the Maker Rain. Thank God, because if he went for a Shadow Ball, that would have taken me out. But I know that this thing is Choice Scarf now, so I'm... I was thinking about going for the will o -Wisp here, but I'm like, nah, man, we're going to go for the Torch Song, see if we can... Um, See if we could hurt something coming in so he does go out to the great tusk again i'm like okay that's perfect i go for the torch song torch song does some good damage and um we're gonna get our special attack boost and with the torch throat spray um we had a plus two but i'm like you know what i don't want to risk a headlong rust i'm gonna go right back into i'm gonna go right right back into my glamora because um we do have that little balloon that this balloon must be heavy man this, these are one of the balloons from the movie up and um he is gonna go for a headlong rust and I'm like nah man you ain't not doing that so i'm pretty sure i will speed this uh great tusk we do and we hit it with an earth pound let's get it, man let's get it. so Great Tusk is down now, and that's a huge threat now. So now I'm able to go for my Stealth Rocks free, freely. So um, now he's going to go out to the Grim Snow again. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. You know what I mean? Um, I'm going to go straight for a Sludge Wave, and uh, here he goes for the Light Screen. I'm like, all right. So um, with the Light Screen up the last time, it's going to do about the same damage. I'm like, okay, that's fine. So here I decided to go for the Stealth Rock, but come to find out this Grim Snow is carrying the Taunt, man. How are you going to make my Glamora mad like that? You know what I mean? But um, I can't use the Stealth Rock with Stinks. But uh, I'm like, you know what? It is what it is. I'm going to go for Earth Power. Because last time, he did switch out to Gold Dango. So, we do go for the Earth Power here. I'm like, what in the bulky is this Grim Snarl? So, um, I'm like, you know what? We could go for another Earth Power. But the bad news is that he wasn't able to get his, um, his Reflect up. So, Grim Snarl is down now. And now, he doesn't have any Pokemon to set up more screens. Thank God. So, here he's going to go out to Espathra, and Espathra is a very scary Pokemon. So, I decided to switch out here, and um, I decided to go into my Toys R Us again, my uh, Farigarath, expecting um, a Psychic move. So, here he actually goes for the Calm Mind, man, going deep thoughts in his little brain. So, this is really bad, because now not only he got a special defense boost, he got a special attack boost. So, this thing is uh, going to hit hard, and it's bulky. So, He's going to go for another Calm Mind again. And I'm like, okay, it is what it is. Uh, now he's at a plus two. And um, here, I decided just to go for the Thunder Wave here. And guess what? I missed the Thunder Wave. I love how my Pokemon love wasting PP. Come on, man. So, his is going to get a speed boost here. And he's going to go for a Dazzle, Dazzle Gleam. That's heaps to me. Crazy, man. Crazy. So, I'm going to set up the light screen here. And um, is going to get another speed boost. So um, here, uh, he goes for another um, Dazzling Gleam, and that's enough to take out my Farigarath, man. Dang. So now, um, the my opponent's Light Screen is going to wear off, and it's going to get another Speed Boost. So here, I decided to go out to the Big Balboski. And I know what you guys are thinking, that, um, you know what I mean, this, this Pokemon is at a plus three. Why would you bring out the uh, Brute Burnett? But I'm like, you know what, we do carry the Sucker Punch here, and... Um, uh, the Espathra does go for a protect. I'm like, okay then. I'm like, you know what? He's probably going to switch out here. So I decided to go for the Spore. He does go for the, um, the Dazzling Gleam. And we're able to eat that up with the Light Screen up. Let's go, man. So we're going to um, throw some mushrooms at this thing, make it psychedelic and sleepy. And um, we're going to eat a little bit of leftovers here. And um, so I'm like, all right. Uh, the, the, my opponent's team's going to reflects on wear off and it's gonna get another speed boost i'm like you know what let's go for the seed bomb see see how much damage it's gonna do right here so we do go for the seed bomb man come on man come on guys you guys are sleeping on brute burnett man this pokemon's a whole problem whole problem you know what i mean problem problem that's how we say it in haiti problem so we're gonna eat a little bit of leftovers here and um here i decided just to play real dirty hit this thing with a sucker punch you know what i mean so we don't play fair 
you know, we always gotta hit you when you're not looking. That's how we work. So, as bathroom is gone now, and um, here we're gonna scream like it's crazy, and we're gonna eat a little bit of leftovers. So, I'm like, all right, who is he gonna go into now? Cause I, now he has two Pokemon left. He has the Breloom and he has the Gold Dango, and um, Breloom comes out here, and here he makes a uh, he makes a double play. So, I'm assuming he's wasting my Reflect turns. But um, yeah, he does go into Goldango and I go for a headbutt, sand headbutt. Well, he probably was scoping out my moves, but I'm like, all right, that's, it is what it is. So I know that this Goldango is Scarf and I'm pretty sure I could take a make it rain from this thing with the light screen up, but I'm um, here. He actually makes uh, another switch. And I'm like, oh man, this Pokemon here. So he goes into uh, Gold, um, Breloom and I go for the Sucker Punch where it, it doesn't work. So we're gonna eat a little bit of the leftovers. That's a good thing, even though he's switching out. So here, uh, he goes for the Mac Punch here. Mac Punch is heaps to me, but I'm like, you know what? I don't really care, man. We're gonna um, we're gonna get, uh, go for the Zen Headbutt. Uh, this Breloom does show me that it's up. We missed the Zen. Come on, man. Brute Burnett, man. Take off your hat so you can see better, man. Crazy, crazy. So I'm like, all right. Uh, I'm going to switch body here and I'm going to go into my King K Road because we could pretty much wall this Breloom if it's not carrying any rock moves. So we do come out here, man. Um, and the Breloom does go for a Mac Punch. I'm like, oh, perfect. So here, the Breloom is going to go for a spoil. I'm like, oh, man, it is what it is. You know what I mean? I'd rather have my Skeletor just sleep than um, any other Pokemon. So uh, we're going to cast some Zs right now. And um, here, he decides to switch out and go into Goldango. I'm like, oh man. So, one thing I completely forgot is that he did not terrestrialize yet. So, he did not terrestrialize. So, I'm not sure which Pokemon he's going to terrestrialize. Either his Goldango or he's going to go into um, his Breloom. But I'm like, you know what? I'm going to switch up out of here and I'm going to go out to the Brute Burnett. So, I'm expecting a Shadow Ball from this thing. But if my Brute Burnett do go down, then it is what it is. So look at this. He does go for uh he does terrestrialize his gold dangle here and he turns it into Terra Ghost. So I'm like, alright then he is gonna probably go for the Shadow Ball here. So um Gold Dangle is gonna terrestrialize and he's gonna jump like he's um jump roping. And uh here he's gonna go for the shadow ball. I'm like, dang man, he's gonna take out my brute burnett. But brute burnett's from Mortal Kombat, man. Kung Lao! Kung Lao! You know what I mean? And um, we're gonna eat a little bit of leftovers, man. This brute has a whole piece. And I'm like, you know what? This guy's gonna switch out of here, be fearing the, um, fearing the sucker punch. But I'm like, you know what, man? Let's 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 show them why we're wearing this hat. And here he's gonna go out to the Breloom. So Breloom comes out here, and we go for the Zen headbutt. Come on, man! You can't outsmart me, boy. Get outsmart me, boy. <laughs> and um, that does heat to the the Breloom hand. And I didn't realize that we was running out of time, man, which is crazy. You know what I mean? So here, I decided to switch out and go into my Skeletor here. So um, we do come out here, man, straight sleeping, you know what I mean, in the battlefield. And um, the Breloom is going to go for a Mac Punch. And uh, here, the timer actually runs out, man, which is crazy. But guys, question of the day, how was your new year? Talk to me. How was your new year? All right, guys, take it easy.